Hello there, this is Jim Ave, your professor or teacher for Taping for Sport. And the purpose of this video is to teach you how to use Moodle. So I'm going to teach you how to uh, change your profile so you have a picture of yourself like I have there. Uh, so when you do different forms, I can see your face. Uh, how to turn in an assignment and also how to post and respond in a form. So let's first start by changing your profile so you have a picture. <clears throat> and so you, if you look, if you go to My Profile Settings, you click that, click Edit Profile, and then your information will be uh, posted there, and then you can add a description if you want, but then you can add a picture, you can find a picture yourself, drag and drop it, in here or you can click this box and then you can browse your hard drive and upload a picture of yourself either way you always got to remember to click the up the update profile uh, button in order for your profile to be updated and then let's go back to our our class then you should see a picture of yourself when you make those changes. Okay, as I'm making this uh, recording, I'm still in the uh, development stage, so the class may look a little bit different, just so you know, uh, but the features that I'm gonna show you are pretty much the same. So let's say you're, you're working on a class, you go through uh, the very first thing is begin this module by completing this form about you. So I ask you some questions about you, and then you want to post all the answers to the question here. You want to click Add New Discussion Topic. Put in the subject about me, and then say something about yourself. If I, I'd like you to increase your font sizes, so how do you do that? You click the, you have different fonts. You have all these different fonts to choose from. And then you have all the different font sizes to use. You can also change your color over here. All a bunch of different colors. You can shade your response. You can bold, you can underline, just like any Microsoft Office uh, Word type product. So let's increase this to 18. And write hello. You can attach a file. Some assignments will ask you to attach a file, some won't. Anyways, what you want to do is end your form by hitting post the form button. I'm not going to do that. So that's how you put your initial post in there. Now if you want to respond back to somebody, you click on the link that says about like this one it says about Jim Ave. You read about what I say and then you hit the reply button. And then again you do the same kind of thing. Change your fonts. Blah 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 blah. And then click post the form, which I'm not gonna do because there's no reason to. And then you have responded to somebody else's post and you have been shown how to put an initial post. And then, so our next one is when we have an assignment due in class. So like for example, this assignment, you click on the assignment link. I have the description for the assignment out here and in the syllabus, they should be the same. Um, then you're going to write a paper using Microsoft Word um, and you'll turn it in. You want to click the Add Submission button here. Again, you're going to download the file or drag and drop from your desktop. So let's say you're just going to add a file. You'll browse your hard drive and select and you know typical type thing how you do add an attachment and an email. Then you want to click Save Changes. I'm not going to do that for this. Um, 
and then it will submit the assignment and then what that does is it sends me an email that you have turned in that assignment and then I'll give you feedback in your paper um, by giving you written comments in your paper and comments when I turn it back into you and you should get an email also when I've graded it if you're noticing I'm clicking the links over on this side of the menu the navigation menu to take me back to di the different pages within Moodle now, other things in Moodle uh, there are there's a resource link over here on the left hand side uh, just different resources uh, for the classes again I'm still building a class so there may be more links now they say you've already clicked the start the class here link so that's where you're at and you're watching this video about the class uh, I've said in my welcome to class this is where you'll get the textbook you just click on this picture and it'll take you to the uh, website for the publisher to get that but that book um, and you'll click this link the picture of the syllabus to download the syllabus which again hopefully you've already listened to the welcome to class presentation where I've covered that so hopefully this has been helpful to teach you how to use Moodle, how to ch include a picture of yourself, how to post to a form, how to turn in an assignment. Those are the main things that you should uh, need to do in this class. And I hope uh, you find this class beneficial to teach you how to tape um, for sport.